So today we're going to take a look at how you can do green screen work in Premiere Pro, also known as Ultra Key. And we're looking at it purely from the perspective of you want to put like a meme video or something on top of like a video of a TikTok or maybe a YouTube video. So we have this base video. They don't really relate these videos at all. I just needed something for a base. It was raining out, so have a rain video. And we already have our green screen video down here. So what we're going to do is first of all, we're going to just overlap these on top. And then we're going to go into our effects panel. And we're going to look for Ultra Key. Once you found that Ultra Key, it's on Video Effects, Key in Ultra Key. We just want to drag that onto our green screen layer, like so. So now if we scroll down in our effects control section and we look for Ultra Key, you're going to see it here, Ultra Key. Now you're going to look for Key Color and all you're going to do is you click this little eyedropper tool and when you go over and click it, click the green. The beauty of a lot of these like meme style green screen videos is they are all one color. So we're not going to go into how to touch up any sort of green screen work if you recorded it yourself but this is how we do it as you can see that is pretty clean if we pull that up on the tilde key you can see there that that cutting is pretty clean if we click along a bit you're going to see that we have no green in around the hair or anything because a lot of these videos are done and they just use one color there's no light variance like you would see on a normal like green screen video if you recorded it. So all we do is once we have this in place, we can just move this around now, increase the size of it or whatever we want to do. So once we have our video in position, we can just go back and of course we can play it and there you can see our green screen video has overlapped on top of our other video. Hope you guys found that useful. Please like, comment, subscribe and I'll see you next time.